Hello, my name is Christopher Clark. I'm one of the developers of Momo2. And here I'm going to be showing Momo answering some long form questions about a video. So I picked this video of a professional soccer game to start. And I'm going to start very simple. I'll just ask it what team scored. And while it's answering, we can look at this clip. And if we fast forward a bit to about halfway through the video, we see the blue team gets this cross and then gets a goal. And of course, Momo can see this and says the blue team scored. Uh, so let's get a bit more detail. So I'll ask it to describe the player that scored. So that should be this player here. So Momo says the player who scored is a dark skinned player wearing a blue jersey with white shoulder stripes and a white number one. That's all correct. He has short hair and is shown sprinting across the field with his arms outstretched. So that's a pretty good description. Uh, now let's ask Momo for some coaching advice. So I'll ask it, what was the white team's critical mistake? So in Momo's opinion, the critical mistake was failing to clear the ball properly. And it notes that the blue team won possession, delivered a well-timed cross into the box, and then the defenders were unable to clear the ball. Uh, and we can just go back and look at this goal to see this. So here's the cross and the white team blocks it, but doesn't clear it, and then the blue team scores. So that's a pretty accurate description of what went wrong for the white team there. Um, and then let's ask another kind of speculative question. So I'll ask it to guess what tournament do you think this game is from? So this isn't explained anywhere in the video, but I'll just see if Momo can guess based on some of the context clues. So Momo's guess, it is a professional European football tournament. It mentions there's the champions branding on the wall. So we can see that like here in the background, there's the word championship on the walls, which is consistent with the UEFA Champions League matches. It also notes that the stands are packed and there is a professional quality broadcast, which all suggests it's from a kind of top tier professional game. So that's a pretty good set of reasoning. And I think that guess is accurate for this game. Um, and then let's ask just one more kind of loose question. So I'll ask it to describe the goal like you are a soccer announcer and uh, use emojis. So mostly just seeing if the model can follow my stylistic destructions. So I won't read this whole thing, but the model says, ladies and gentlemen, what a goal. And then it gives a soccer emoji and then goes on like this following the style. So these kind of multi-sentence uh, instruction following answers are all of what we've come to expect from AI models. But it's actually quite challenging to get these into open source video models because almost all the data that people train on to get this kind of behavior is closed source. So a big part of what we did with Bulmo is develop new open source data and training code that you can use to train fully open models that can still give these kind of long detailed answers and follow instructions when looking at a video. Uh, thank you.